morning everyone we are in the car and we are headed to the library um tuesdays and wednesdays usually i don't have too much planned as far as chores go and as much as i wanted to stay home because i am exhausted um we really need to return our library books and we haven't been to our library that's close to our house yet so i thought we should go i know that um the library that Jane had her school at and the St. Andrews library or something are like the best ones with the kids section. So I'm not sure if this one that we're gonna go to has the best Hi, kitty area, me. but we'll see. Good job. So we might not stay for long. We might just return the books and then look around for a minute, but um, at least we're gonna get out and kill some time. It's about 10.30 in the morning. <laughs> Jane has her Anna and Elsa. And look at you, you're cute. And I look like Elsa. Yep, mommy has hair like Elsa today and so does Jane. We got our French braids. It is a hot one. So it is already 88 degrees. Feels a lot hotter than that, but anyways, we are headed to the library. We're gonna bring you guys with us. All right, let's return the book. Beans Baker bounces back. Bye bye. Okay, put it in. Dancing dinos. Dancing dinos. Bye bye. My princess and puppies. Bye bye. All right. library actually really really late normally we eat lunch like right at 12 and the kids go down for a nap at 1 but we didn't get home till 1 o'clock we were having so much fun at the library the kids took their nap and I took a little nap too and now it is time for everyone to get up Jane didn't fall asleep till like 3 30 so she's still laying in bed but she's awake slowly getting up Jackson came in to play with her and now I'm going to attempt to get some stuff done here in Piper's room. My mom um, went through all these little bloomers and put them in the sizes that they are for me, which was really nice. And this room still looks like a disaster though. So the reason why I say attempt is because if the kids come in here and start uh, making too big of a mess, I might need to wait until they're not in here. So we'll see how this goes. I'm just going to do this until it is time for dinner. Let the kids play upstairs. They love playing upstairs um, the best. So 
Jane is gonna slowly get up out of bed. She moved a little bit. You ready to get up? No. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try to organize these newborn baby clothes. You gonna help me? See, look at all these girl clothes. What? You can read some books. Now lots of books. Okay, so the good news is I think we have enough newborn and zero to three clothes for Piper. The thing is, it's gonna be really, really hot for the first three months of her life. July, August, September, even into October, it's pretty hot. Basically, she's only gonna be wearing like a onesie probably the whole entire time. Even when she's inside, she'll probably just wear a onesie and then like a little light blanket or something over her when she's like in the swing or something. So I really didn't need anything. Like when Jane was born, she was born in December. We needed jackets, we needed socks, we needed pants, onesies, all of that. Um, but this time we really only need onesies, like I said. So um, here are all of the onesies that I have that are um, newborn and zero to three. And I'm gonna go back through them and put the newborn ones on the top, but they're basically all the same size. And then I have a few, like four pairs of pants, which I doubt I will use, but just in case. And then in here I have one, two, three, four jammies. And then I bought her three other little sleepers. So that's seven pajamas which is I do laundry every week so that should last us and if she needs to sleep in a onesie that's okay too um otherwise I have like these little booties which I don't know if she'll wear um there's a bib here's some more onesies that I need to put in there some little hats which I'm sure she probably won't even wear, wear hats maybe a few times at the hospital um these little dresses which will be really nice when we're out um, a lot airier than a onesie. She can just wear this, these little dresses. And then there's like passies and stuff that Jane never used. And then look at all these newborn headbands that Jane had. So, like I said, the good news is I think we are set to go for newborn stuff. Might need a few more jammies, but I think we can get by if we needed to. And then we have, I'm gonna go ahead and hang all the three month clothes that she has. That way, normally I transfer my children up to their room around three months. And so I don't wanna pack away the three month stuff. I can just hang it up. And so this is all three months clothes. So I'm not sure exactly what I have. I just threw it all over there. And then here's some stuff that I'm taking to the hospital with me. Um, Here's some more headbands that are a little bit bigger, not like newborn headbands. And then the rest of these clothes I need to go through and sort by size so that I can put them back in the bins and then back up in the attic and then I can bring them down when I need to or even just back in her closet, I don't know. But anyways, I'm getting stuff done. The kids are being quiet, so you know how that is. That could be a bad thing. Let's see what they're doing in here. <laughs> Hi. Mom, you guys doing okay? Yeah, guess what I found. What? I think Jackson wanted to get out and somebody had trapped him in. I did. You did. I know you did. Okay, Jackson. Oh no, buddy. Buddy. Uh-oh. He just came and knocked this whole thing over. All right, I'm gonna clean this. Uh-oh, it was right. So Jackson can almost open the door by himself, which may cause a problem here in a little bit. I just saw him try and open the door. He's almost tall enough and he knows how it works. So that'll be interesting when the time comes. But anyways, we just ate some dinner. Now I'm trying to clean up around here in the kitchen and in the living room. 
we had a messy dinner, so Jackson is still just in his diaper. One of the dogs threw up, so I had to clean up with that. I got a lot done in Piper's room, which I'm really happy about. I pretty much got all of the clothes organized into um, size, but there's a ton of clothes in Jane's closet as well that don't fit her that I need to go through before I put them back into the bins because I don't want to put them back into the bins and then find other sizes that I need to put in order. So I also want to go through Jackson's clothes that don't fit him anymore because I'm sure there's some like gender neutral. I now have some like white onesies and some other like gender neutral um, clothes that he can pass down to Piper as well. So we're doing good. I'm feeling a little bit better about everything. I think I will feel the best when my hospital bag is packed. So I'm gonna probably do that here in the next few days or so. What? Guys, um, Hannah had a medicine ear. We put medicine in Hannah's ear, huh? She has an ear infection. Yeah, she, and she has a booba inside her ear. Right, Mom? Yeah. Yeah, so oh. we put, Mommy put medicine in her, um, and, okay. and, and her, and her ear, inside her ear. So that's what, my mom is wanting to talk to you guys. Yep. We're going to go ahead and end the vlog, right? We just put Jackson to bed. I need to take a shower and Jane's probably just going to hang out for a little bit before we go to bed. Yeah. And we're going to try to go to bed a little bit yeah. early tonight. So, yeah. the dogs are eating, yeah. getting their medicine. River has his arthritis medicine. Yeah. Hanny has her ear infection medicine. Yeah. We have one more day, one yeah. more full day until daddy yeah. comes yeah. home. Yeah. So that's exciting. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. Um, tomorrow we have yeah. some um, exciting stuff that we're going to be doing yeah. at home. So yeah. stay tuned for that. Yeah. If you guys like today's vlog, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Well, don't I'll forget do to it. comment below so we I can chat. Do it. Don't I'll forget do it. to subscribe. Wait, I want to do oh. it. I hope you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe and see you tomorrow. Bye. Jane has been such a good big sister lately in general. Um, she has been bathing Jackson. We put them in the bathtub together and of course, Either Chris or I sit there and watch them. We don't leave them unattended, but Jane 